Hi guys, so I finished restoring the Vilius Mark 7 slash 1. Uh, went with the red in the end because I couldn't be able to restore the lower mire, so I wasn't going to go with the green. Um, came out really nice, I think. Um, seeing from the previous videos and stuff that I've done, the uh, engine block, the carb rebuilding, uh, a couple of other things that I didn't have to have time to make a video on. Um, the inside of the fuel tank was really, really rusted. I'll include some pictures to show what it looked like before. I did the gravel trick. Um, you see the uh, mounting bolt holes here. I put a piece of threaded rod, same thread as the tank, in there and then put it in a drill held in a vise and just let it churn for a few hours. Uh, and that managed to clear out quite a lot of stuff actually. Another thing that I had a bit of problem with on this engine was the uh, fuel tap here. Um, see it's got a plunger here that's open, that's closed. Um, on the end of that plunger there's a sort of cork sleeve um, and that had completely perished and uh, yeah, it wasn't fuel tight at all so I had to uh, get an old wine cork and I tried it on the lathe but that just didn't work so in the end I just had to kind of whittle it to shape and uh, that seems to be working quite well now. Also had some uh, problems getting the idling right. Um, the whole points assembly behind the flywheel is on a plate and you can rotate that to uh, advance or retard it and um, the only point I could find where it would run was with it hard towards the retard direction. Um, it just seemed a bit odd that it would be kind of hard in one direction right up against the edge. The only way I could try and get it to run more in that direction would be to file out the slots that allow it to uh, rotate so I wasn't going to do that but uh, yeah, I managed to get it running fairly good. It's, it seems to be sort of bedding in the longer it runs. One thing I do need to do for this engine still is buy a new um, spark plug cap. The old one that uh, was on there, I think it's got like this little graphite sort of stem inside it connecting the clip onto the top of the spark plug to the kind of screw thread bit out going out to the HT lead and that had broken so there was no connection between the two so I've got a new one coming off those off eBay. Um, this one I've just nicked off the little BSA engine. So overall I think it came out really nice, the, um, the paint's good, um, so I just want to get uh, some decent wooden maker sled for it, um, I'll make some sort of bracket to mount the throttle control there, um, and then you can just sort of adjust it on the base and leave it running. Okay, so give it a like and a subscribe if you want, and um, thanks for watching, hopefully I'll have some more videos of this and other projects coming out soon, so thanks for watching, bye.